Welcome to Lavile Stadium in San Francisco. Uh, if it's fine by you, Grim, I'll probably just stand as we call this game. And what's the issue, partner? Uh, let's just say I got a little too much of the San Francisco nightlife last night. <laughs> I don't remember the majority of it. Thank God, I was raised Catholic. Today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams take the field. The Los Scandalous Damned battle. The San Francisco 40 Nightmares. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hello once again, everyone. Grim Blitzrow here, along with Brickhead Mulligan. Huh? Hey, how'd your checkup go? Well, good news, bad news. Doc says I passed my physical. Oh, that's good. But I flunked my model. Not too good. Well, I, it's 50-50. Better odds than I get in Vegas. Get a point. And it's first and ten. You know, Bricks, a lot of people have gotten pass happy in this league. Nice to see some old school mano a mano on the turf, huh? And it's first and ten. He hit that line the way a Republican congressman hits the airport men's room. Good and hard. First down. And it's first and ten. Receiver like glue. There's a funny red head on the field. No, that's their red penalty marker, Bricks. Looks like this one's coming back. <laughs> and it's first and ten. <laughs> and that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Second down and a lot. He's got his beast boost working. The player just transformed into a violent form of... Oh, and he breaks free and his nookie but a boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, I'm going in circles. First and ten. See that boo, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that. Too fast. <laughs> the home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. It's a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. That run is good for ten yards. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Sorry, partner. Boom, and he's dead. Ah, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. And it's first and ten. They've been known to rip the heads off of enemy players. First down. Give this guy a few catches and... Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma. 
Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. Yeah, it was probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crack their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but you know, not the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know right now. What day is it? First and ten. Holy crap! He runs straight into a mutant trap and dies! Reminds me of my breakfast cereal, the old nut crunch. Second down and ten. Looks like a pass, and it's bouncing right back to the QB. Oh, it's the sticky ball dirty trick. Ah, oh, pass the popcorn, Grim. Zoom in on his face, then his crotch. I want to see if he cries or pisses himself first. Third down and long. And like Bricks' bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. And it's first and ten. It's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. And they run it for a couple of yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. This guy's a brick. He could go all the way. The 10. Touchdown. And he rumbles that one into the end zone. Nicely done. I can't run like that unless it's Cooper Knight and Taco Hell. He has better footwork, though, than me. On a kind of not clenching his cheeks, though. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. First and ten. Second down in a very lot. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. 
When it's your time to go, it's your time. Third down and nine. Gets in there and swats the ball away. He can't catch, but he sure can swat. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. The return man catches the ball and heads up field. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. And it's first and ten. Destruction in his path. Holy crap! He missed time to spice and ends up dead. Life is full of. Oh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so do the fans. Second down in a lot. And he's missed the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And we've got a tight battle here as quarter one comes to an end. Finally. And it's first and ten. And the defense goes for the jugular. And that unsportsmanlike play of the day brought to you by the good folks at Speedy's Drop. The offense has only two quarterbacks remaining on the roster. They better be careful because when those guys die, it's forfeit city. And it's first and ten. And they've had enough. The offense jumps off sides and attacks the ref. First down and forever. Defense was there, but he still picked up a yard somehow. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half. You can tell he's a berserker because he's frothing at the mouth. Oh, that's it! Great play by the defense. It's not too often a quarterback gets rejected. That's why that's the position I originally tried out for. I want to know what it's like for other people to accept you. Now that went from a joke to making me feel feelings. Stop it. This isn't a place to feel feelings. This is football. Oh, and the defender cut off that pass like a suburban mom on the way to speak. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And it's first and ten. Second down and long. Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. And it's first and ten. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. Second down in a very lot. Oh, he just got pulverized by a mutant trap. Goal! If you ever do that again,
Martin Briggs all shoot you in the head. But people like it. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? Second down and nine. warming up. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completion. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I had to check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more! And it's first and ten. Quarterback has had enough and calls a murder ball dirty trick to Lynn. He picks up nine yards on that catch. And that'll bring up second and one. They go to the ground game and pick up the first. Nicely done. The offense has no running backs left, so this becomes a passing-only offense. Uh, they can still run it with their QB, right, Grim? Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it! First down and five. And that'll be second and eight to go. And he just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. First and ten. One speed in game. Boom. Second and three. Oh man, I love this dirty trick. The corner, he's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. You know, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. 
Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. First and ten. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. Under two minutes, a timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock, and he better win. And it's first and ten. The QB saved some clock by calling a timeout. They have one left. Second down and more than the QB would like. And that's the kind of play you pay the secondary for. You pay him for the pick six. For this, you just give him a pat on the head and tell him they don't suck. Third down and, well, good luck. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. They let the punt drop, and it will be down by the defense. And it's first and ten. He's into it in there for a four-yard gain. And that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. Second down and six. First down. First time out under two minutes. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. And it's first and ten. He is fighting. Oh, sure. Now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him. They stopped the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Uh, that's okay, Grim. They can have mine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do. Second down, and the quarterback burns his last timeout. They can't stop the clock anymore. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. I am so confused! And he picks up 10 on that run. Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Yeah. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. The offense is down to their last quarterback. If they lose him, they lose the game. It's a close battle as the quarter ends. Halftime is brought to you by those caring folks at Monsatan Industries. They make the world a better place by making the government tell you it is. It's anyone's game as the third quarter begins. Both teams have taken their performance-enhancing drugs, and everyone is ready to rock and roll. The teams line up for the second half kickoff. Hey, man, I was going to kill him now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Does the QB know which team he's on? 
If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He can have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. He broke free and has open field in front of him. He's at the ten. They're gaining on him. Hey, come on, move your ass. I got a saw buck running on this asshole. Yo, man, nobody can touch you when I fall. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it's good. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. <laughs> Ten yards. Oh, mama. Just call him Captain Crunch. Another one bites the dust. <laughs> Second down in a very lot. Interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. Oh, man, what a throw. That sonic blast just to... Oh, with the brain scrambler. Team like a rush drum solo. They come up big today with a solid win, and the opposition will be licking their wounds on the long plane ride home. My own wounds taste just like chicken. How was it Scrambles tomato soup? I forget, but a good scab tastes like bacon. Damn, I know. Mm-mm, a scab lettuce tomato sandwich. Sounds like a picnic. And the MVP is about to inspire us with some words of wisdom. <laughs> Grim Blitzro with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...